I've got one hell of a haul. Um, yay. Okay, so I'll start off. I've got this gorgeous white Patagonia. Um, it's got like these little blocks inside. I don't know, it's really sweet. Um, this one's already actually up in my posh closet. Um, cause I just like things eating like that. Yay! Okay, so I love it. There's nothing wrong with it. Um, it's a size medium, it's women's. Got this bad boy at the bins. Love it, yay. Super cute, great condition. If it were small, would've kept it. Okay, I've got this really adorable cabbie sweater. Um, it's red, it's got like these blue like stitching in it. It's super adorable. Um, it's an extra small. All of this stuff will be in my posh closet if it already isn't. Um, this, oops, um, an extra, extra small Eileen Fisher. Um, just like button up. It's really cute. It's in really good condition. Um, light wearing, there's no stains. Super cute. Super cute. Um, okay. Um, so I've got three other Patagonia pieces that are not for sale. They are going to Patagonia's worn wear program because they, there's like things wrong with them. And so if they can fix them or they can fix them and then resell them, then that's great. Uh, I just think the, I like supporting the companies that are going green and are environmentally conscious because they need to be. Um, oops. This super adorable um, Urban Outfitters, it's BDG. Um, this dress, it's a size zero. Super cute, super cute. I love that. It's long, I tried it on, it goes past my knees. But it's really cute. It just made me look short. Okay, um, also this really cute Saturday, Sunday top from Anthro. It's got these really cute buttons on the back. So yeah, it's really cute. It's Saturday, Sunday. From Anthro. It's a medium. This is uh, Lulu. It's but it already sold. <laughs> Super quick. Super cute. It was an eight. Otherwise, I would have kept it. If it were a two or a four, if you ever have anything in your store for a two or a four, hit me up. More often than not, um, I will always buy it. <laughs> um, Cabby, just cute, super soft tank. I feel like it's rayon. Yeah, 100% rayon, 2% fabric. I mean, present spandex. It's all fabric. Go me. Um, this really adorable Nike sweatshirt. It's gray. I love it. When I first saw this, I thought it was North Face or Patagonia, just because it kind of looks like a, a better sweater type type sitch. Here's another one of those uh, Patagonias that I'm gonna send in for the worn wear. But I love these if this weren't so dingy, these quilted 100% cotton. Oh, it's so soft, it's like a cloud. I just love soft things. Um, this Patagonia better sweater is in my size, but it's got, okay. Yeah, got a hole in the arm. That's okay. Worn wear program. I'll let you all know how that plays out with itself because sometimes I just don't know. Okay. Uh, J. Crew, size two. White eyelet top. It's adorable. I love it. Love it. 
no stains, no nothing. Perfect for spring, summer. This holding horses, anthro, peplum, e top. It's not buttoned up, so give me it. Oh no, momental. I'll button it up. I feel like. Okay, so I've got this holding horses top. Super cute. See, it's got like that peplum look to it. Love it. Love it. Okay, soft surroundings. Feels like 100% linen. There are no holes, so this will sell super fast. Um. I can't even tell what size it used to be. It's like a large. Really cute. Whoever had this prior took really good care of it. I found this theory. Large top, so soft. No holes, stellar condition. Oh. Uh, ninety four percent Pima cotton, six percent spandex. Love it. Made in Peru. Um, Ibex. Um, made in USA. I. Uh, this is what the this is what the logo looks like. Oh well, I guess it was on the thing too. I found a. There's nothing wrong with it. There are no holes. The reason I'm covering my face is the light kind of like shines through the fabric, so I have to be able to tell better. So anyway, so I found a um, a vest, a men's extra large vest over uh, winter break back in Seattle, in the Seattle area, and I put it up for, I think, 60. And it sold in like 20 minutes, or maybe I put it on for less. I'll have to go back and check, but regardless, it sold within like 25 minutes so I know I uh, one it's in high demand two uh, I underpriced it <laughs> but that's okay because I got it the really cute like thermal pants um, I may toss these in with the other worn wear stuff just because it'll go towards a credit that I get these are from 2012 but still there's no holes so I could get a couple bucks back for that Whoa. Uh, ooh, lemon uh, white tank it's like a like a faded green it's really cute it's a size 4 it's my size I haven't tried it on I'm not gonna try it on I'm just gonna sell it got three drawers dedicated to strictly little lemon here don't mean to do anymore. Okay, got this men's North Face. It's it's in really good condition, but uh, they're you know like the sleeves are kind of meh. So I know North Face also has a um, kind of like a worn wear program like Patagonia, so I may check theirs out and see what it's like. Uh, but I may also just try to throw it up on uh, Poshmark and try to just sell it for 25 bucks or so. Uh, a cabbie, like, jacket, blazer type thing. Oh, I love it. It's wool. It's size 10. Super cute. Back's cute, too. But just the detail. Love it. Love it. Love it. <sighs> These Hudson's. They're shiny. <laughs> Not really my forte, but um, I know they're in good condition because the hardware that's on here is painted and there's like no chipping. And you can just, the slime is still. Yeah. <laughs> Miss Me's. I love Miss Me's. And wait. Mock revivals because they they just flip really quick I put these on um, like higher up like a higher up I priced them higher because they're both in really really good condition 
but then the idea that you know I have is kind of over overpricing to an extent where you still get likes but at the same time you're you're asking more than what you initially wanted for the given item so then if someone you know offers you less than you're like still thinking you're getting more that just happened today with a jacket I put on I put it on for 60 someone offered me 50 and I was like yep makes sense <laughs> sure um cute lucky brand jean jacket it's got oh other side it's got just a little heart on it it's the tomboy trucker jacket so cute. I love it. It fit me, but I'm moving to Scottsdale and I don't need jackets. So. Super cute. I feel like this would, is going to be like a rare unicorn find. Um, Edme and I don't know. I'm just, I'm not going to butcher it, <laughs> but this, this, we know this from Anthro. Pronunciation was never my forte, but it's so cute. Like, I bet it's a unicorn. I haven't looked it up yet. I'll let you know. It's a size small. Um, made well, super cute, extra small little flannel dress. I literally had the exact same one and I sold it I think for like 30 so I'll probably just try to get the same um, again this time. Free people. The free peeps. Size large. It's like a very sheer fabric. But it's really soft. Almost all of free people stuff is soft. I feel like I can tell by how worn it is by this tag and the fact that it's still straight and there's no like bunching or fraying of it it's in really good condition yeah love it okay these free people shorts size 24 these fit my waist um but these like constricted my legs <laughs> me for girls with pretzel legs not with not for girls that, you know, work out or anything. Okay. This Joey feels like 100% silk top. It's an extra, extra small. It's got these cute little butterflies on it. That's butterfly. 100% silk. Boom. Uh, another cappy. Large. Like blazer or jacket. This is also super soft. I just... I'm attracted to soft things because I don't wear gloves when I go to the bins. I've never worn gloves. I tried wearing gloves and I can't do it because I now know brands, some brands, by the feel. And granted, I think it's boosted my immune system. I have not gotten sick in over a year and a half. But I do still get vaccinated. But I just think it boosts my immune system. So I just more so I I I'm not selling this so there's this it's this Liz Claiborne uh, blazer but I just liked the, the fabric on this I have a um, an assignment that I have to do uh, before the semester ends where we take an article of clothing and like make it into something new and I think I'm going to do it with that, but I haven't quite figured out what exactly I should make from that. So if anyone has any ideas, like, let me know, let me know, let me know, let me know, let me know. Um, I also found this Christian Dior blue sweater that is so soft. It's got the cute little logo on it. Yeah in the USA. Love it, right? 
cute. Cute, cute, cute. And that's kind of it. I found this other dress. I don't know the brand. And it's called Quinn. But it just, it was cute. I love dresses. I love dress season. Um, it looks kind of sheer, so I may have to wear a slip under it. But I just, I love wearing dresses when it gets warm out. Yeah, that's really it. That's really it. So... Yeah. Oh, no, no, there's these two. I was going to wash it. Uh, this too. This is all it's because it's soft. Rabaton, Aritzia. It's so cute. It's like this off shoulder y, slouchy top. It's kind of a funky color. Like, I don't. I guess now with blonde or hair, I could. I don't know, but okay, so um, I'm gonna put my Instagram below because um, I'm more likely to be on there than I am to be on here because uh, I'm still a college student and that is consuming my life. Um, yeah, and I try to post either on my story or um, on my feed daily. So yeah, just give me a follow and uh, yeah, thanks for coming to my first haul. I feel like that was pretty successful. I feel accomplished. So, all right. The middle schooler's still in me.